That was a really rough semester in econ. I kind of wish we had tried harder. You ever wonder what would happen if we actually did? I don't know, it would probably be pretty awesome. Tried the AC con, but it got the best of me. But that's fine, for success I got the recipe. Now all A's are your destiny, you see. Econ is everywhere. Capitalism in the air, free trade the stocks and shares. Point them out and you will be aware. Take you from peasant to millionaire. But you're taking your advice from a hockey player. If I'm gonna talk econ, I need to get my geek on. Running through lines like Santa's comedy on. Starts off with supply and demand. Until you get that, man, you won't understand. Supply to the sky and demand down low. Price of equilibrium without a ceiling or flow. Spice and cotton can make a price drop. For example, substitutes from a Macklemore thrift shop. We see the shifters every single Wednesday with lines backed up to get an a la carte. I'll take some preferences for those smoothies. But spend like that and broke is what you'll be. Econ helps predict when to save and spend. Like those Mayans predicted the world would end. Micro is basically a market measurer and I would know. I'm class treasurer. Gotta understand all the market structures. With perfect competition, you get more picks than Cutler. Monopoly, oligopoly, get through the monotony. But without these entry barriers, first say you're not blocking me. Falcon Problems was the only one tweeting. Then Falcon Nice came and started competing. Monopolistic competition, now that's a mouthful. Will you ever need to know this? Well, that's doubtful. If you get a firm and you're calling the shots, don't forget to factor opportunity cost. It's like when I go and try to wheel women, probably more productive to stay at home sitting. But I figure the cost is well worth the risk, even after I take my swing and I miss. After that, all that time I just lost, wheeling on women, it's a sunk cost. Look at all the cash my boy Christian just lost, but that's really only the explicit costs. The implicit costs are enough to match it, but that's what you get for chasing after ratchets. Like when I cut my hair, all I was missing was just 10 bucks and about a dozen inches. But the total cost was much higher for me, cause every girl here no longer adores me. Running out of time for the lesson of the day, can't even talk about the triple play. Boy, it's been great, but I can't stay, but it's been a blast. So let me just say, from the guy in econ, where you can find napping, and who wishes he meant this didn't happen, who got up and said, sorry Dave Wilkin, I wouldn't call this a life-changing moment. Allow us slackers to express our gratitude, giving us a few minutes just to sit and rap at you, even with a little bit of attitude. Hopefully you learned something, if not, we're not mad at you. It's up to you to learn the rest. Hopefully we taught you enough to pass the test. Or at least you're just a little bit wiser. If not, you can just cheat off Matt Weisberg. It's Weisberg. I can not see his arm right there, sliding it all of like six inches. ...through the monotony, but without these entry barriers, firm say you're not blocking. <laughs> Then Falcon Nice came and started competing. That's the reaction. That's... <laughs> Do we ever need to know this? <laughs>